Hello Taurus, welcome to your love reading. This is for October. Uh, thank you so much for being here, you guys. Welcome if you're new. Uh, please hit that bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos and subscribe. Uh, let's get right into this reading, you guys. Please only take what fits, what resonates and makes sense to you. And whatever doesn't, just leave it on out. It may be a message for someone else. I think that's it, you guys. Here we go. For Taurus, what does Taurus need to know in regards to love? All right. Beautiful strength here. Okay. All right. So what I'm seeing here, Taurus, there's definitely been, um, like a turn of events here. I feel like there's someone here who really put you through it. I feel like this person could, was really ruthless. This person was very controlling. This person may have even been really immature when it comes to you, when it comes to love, when it comes to responsibility. I uh, definitely see separation here, okay? Possible ending because it's just been too much. Like a lot of you just saying, I'm done. This has been way too much. Uh, it's, it's just too much on you to where you're ready for positive change and you're ready to break certain cycles. Now, when I was pulling uh, the strength card here and I said beautiful strength here I'm definitely feeling like this is you I feel like this is a time where not only are you coming into your own but seizing and taking your power back I see that you're gonna really let this person know listen enough is enough I'm not having it I'm not dealing with it even just in dating general like if you start to see red flags it's like you guys have had a lot of time to think about the situation or to think about certain things when it comes to your love life and I see you standing strong I also see a lot of attention coming your way so prepare for that like there's someone who has their eyes on you there may even be someone here who's thinking really heavily about you and this connection now i feel like this is someone who is really attracted to you this is someone here who's really pondering what to do here about you and about this about the connection whether to move forward whether to go for it okay there is definitely a spark here an insane chemistry here as well for those of you who are dating someone or this is new or this is fresh okay but there's a lot of fun as well a lot of excitement all right really any interesting energies here but i definitely see a lot of you have separated here from someone and are focused on your peace focused on you focused on having fun focused on setting boundaries focused on that beautiful strength of yours that I mentioned okay that's really important I want to make sure that I state that clearly all right but yeah definitely getting rid of someone here who was just really hurtful ruthless um, this person could have been really selfish as well when it comes to uh, exchanging uh, energy right providing doing what's necessary just love right work effort I feel like this person just took 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 uh, and this person definitely caused a lot of conflict here a lot of issues here you may have been dealing with someone where the two of you were just opposites and it wasn't going to work because you just saw things differently here so you separated from this person instead of continuing to go through um um, this up and down this this constant energy where it's just back and forth with this person okay now some of you might just right now be enjoying doing your own thing needing time to think needing time to clear your energy but when you are ready Taurus I'm telling you there's going to be this uh, social energy where you're just out and you're having fun and you're doing your thing and you're glowing that strength here when I said beautiful strength like someone is going to see this feel this notice this about you and admire it okay there's someone who's definitely gonna have their eyes on you I'm seeing two lovers here come together two people who really want to merge together have a life together this is part of a beautiful change this is part of a chemistry that works it has that important balance where you keep the peace, you respect boundaries, and you're open and honest and calm during obstacles. That's what I'm seeing here for you, Taurus, okay? Letting go of someone who felt like they had the control for too long. Like, yeah, you're definitely claiming your power, your strength back. You have Libra here. Leo, Leo coming through strong, Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, okay? And also Aries and Gemini. 
So let's move forward. Let's get a little bit more, Taurus. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. And forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, Taurus, you experience more love. In your present moments. It's all about, for those of you who resonate with that, moving forward. Who's meant to come in? The next chapter for you. Peace. Solitude. Happiness. Positive attitudes. A beautiful exchange. Coming together. Merging together. Okay? Someone who's really ready to engage with you. That's that lover's energy right there on the bottom of the deck, okay? It is safe for you to love, so open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Not letting this person who could have been cruel, ruthless, immature, selfish, greedy, uh, liked control, keep you down, stop you from moving forward, right? It's all about going. It's all about moving. Things that are meant to happen. Changes that are meant to happen for the greater good for you. No one can stop that. Hold on to your strength here. There's a lot of releasing that's necessary. A lot of healing that's necessary. What else? Okay. All right, we'll take that one. Yeah, one more. One more for Taurus, please. So what flew out was soulmate. Yes, this person is your soulmate. There is a strong spiritual bond between you and this person. This card pertains to friendships with kindred souls and attracting the right people. There it is right there, Taurus. Attracting the right person. Some changes are meant to happen. Some of these changes give us that lesson of forgiving and learning to move forward. To not stop with your dreams, your values, your goals when it comes to that lover's energy, right? It's all about moving forward and attracting that right one. So don't forget to take that time to rest, that time to think, that time to grow here because it's going to happen. Especially with that will of fortune. Attracting the right one. One more. And have faith. Have faith that the right people and situations will come to you. This card is confirmation that you made the right decision. For those of you who separated, for those of you who let go, for those of you who spoke your peace, for those of you who are tapping into your inner strength, as hard as it may be sometimes, but you have it and it's there. Have faith. You're on the right path. That's what that card is all about. Have faith. And stay flexible. You may have met someone or have someone in mind, but your spirit guides want you to know that there are better options for you. So this card re retains to releasing unrealistic expectations, right? Letting it go if you know it's not for you deep down inside. That inner courage and strength to let go and to focus on what's best for you. Be flexible because again, when those changes happen, it just brings in what's meant for you and you want to be ready, right? You want to enjoy the ride. You want to go with it. Welcome it with open arms. Stay flexible. Stay ready and have faith. That's the message here, okay. For Taurus. You're unlocking happiness here. Be vulnerable and open yourself to real love. Taking a chance, being free. Someone here who's been exposed. Also, someone who is ready to be vulnerable ready for that kind of love, right? That kind of happiness. I feel like that's a part of this new beginning here. It may feel like you're taking a chance. It may feel like a risk here. 
Now there's a love song. Let love's melody inspire your dance together. There's harmony, rhythm, and being in sync. Yeah, insane chemistry. This person who's coming in, this soulmate is going to understand you and show you deep commitment. That's what that lovers is all about. It's the kind of love that you give, the kind of love hand in hand. You go through together. You experience it together. Okay, it has that flair of friendship, but yet lover. And also very spiritual. All right. Burning bright. Stoke passion to keep the flame of love alive. There's intimacy, sparks, and warmth. Keep that faith and hold that strength. Keep that strength, okay? Show that strength, that confidence. It's all how you wield it here. Is that queen of swords? She's going to let you know, okay? Male, female, the energy of this card is, I'm going to let you know. I will let you have it if I need to. She has the strength to do so. Just respect it. It's confident. It's all about that self-love and knowing what you want and what you don't. That's the beautiful strength here that I was talking about. Okay, let's see. You only burn bright, shine bright. That's that beautiful queen of wands energy. This is what you gain from letting go and moving forward and healing. All right. Wings of love. Give yourself the love's wings and it will return to you multiplied, right? Letting go, being free, not holding on to what's holding you back or setting you back but really having true freedom here to embrace love. Those blessings that are coming in, it says blessed on that card. Beautiful. Flying free. You're unlocking happiness here. This is the bottom. Here we go. All right. Fluttering heart. Your passion leads you to the love you desire. There it is. Attraction, pursuit, Beautiful. Attracting that person, right? Meant to be. That will of fortune. It says destiny. That lover's energy. Magnetic. Being drawn to each other. Meant to meet each other. It's going to burn bright. Why? Shows real intimacy. The sparks. The warmth. That fire. The desire. Beautiful. Now, here's the bottom. Inner compass. Trust your instincts to lead you in the right direction. Pay attention, Taurus, to your intuition. You are being guided. It's all a part of your life path. These changes, these cycles, what you're learning. Some of you having to learn that hard lesson of separating, letting go, taking that time to learn from it, right? Okay. What else for Taurus? Return. Someone from your past may want to return. And there's compromise on the bottom. Compromise is not submission. Someone here may have some control issues and they need to let go. They may need to learn how to compromise. There's that forgiveness, right? Letting go to release yourself, to release the heavy weight, the heavy burden, the stress, the worry, that negative energy. Beautiful strength there as well. To forgive. Not to forget, but to forgive. It's all a part of learning. It releases the tension for you. That act of forgiveness. Okay. What else? What does Taurus need to know? It takes a lot to forgive someone who's hurt you. Soul. Your soul is preparing to reconnect. Trust the process. Have faith. You are on the right path. Why? How do you know? The inner compass. 
your inner knowledge, your intuition. It's guiding you. There's a lot of synchronicity here, okay? A lot of signs. Now, these signs might lead you to this soulmate here who's coming in. Divine timing right now. It brings a divine soul counterpart. A relationship that is blessed with amazing moments of synchronicity. Appreciating those little things. Those big signs, little signs. Precious moments here. for Taurus confusion someone is puzzled unsettled and they're unclear someone needs time to think there's trust dedication loyalty this may be something that is important Something that you know that you deserve and you're not going to stand for less. Someone that is reliable. Someone you're thinking a lot. That time alone is giving a lot of time to do just that. To think. To learn. There's heart fog here. Look at that. Mixed signals. Blocked emotions. A lot of clutter. There is a slow uh, disconnect here, Taurus, okay? It does feel like slowly, it's like you may be releasing this connection. All the clutter, the confusion, the hard fog, the mystery, the hurt, the, those unexpected shocks, okay? Drifting slowly apart here, breaking the cycles, breaking the patterns. My heart won't ever be the same. When I hear our song, it still hurts. A lot of signs here. And you are my muse. On the bottom, Taurus, meet me halfway. See, there's this drifting here. there's someone here that likes to be alone or like they're always uh, like doing their own thing like they just they might not like to be out a lot but there is this social energy as well someone who loves to be out so you and your person may be different there but learning to compromise oh okay these two all right there it is. Step into your power. Step into your strength. That inner compass. That inner knowing. And embrace the flow of life. All about the changes here. Flying free. Take the time. Here's that Herman energy, Taurus, to think it through. Take the time to think it through. There may be an important decision here. But just know you're on the right path. And you're attracting that real intimacy. That flame that doesn't burn out. It burns bright. Free. Vulnerable. Open. A beautiful love song here, okay? And remember that like attracts like. If you long for more love, be more loving. There's a lot about compromising here and maintaining a balance, especially when there are differences, different views, whatever it may be, different hobbies, different ways of being. That's normal, right? Natural. It happens. But finding that right balance. What you put out, you give back. Someone here may be having to really think and to learn this tough lesson of how to balance 
to maintain, to grow. There's a lot here about forgiveness, okay? Forgiving and moving forward, forgiving and learning. That is your message, Taurus. Ooh, that was a big one. Okay, thank you, you guys, for watching, for being here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.